guys it's uh 3000 subscribers hello welcome to this uh adult swim portion ng ating programa dito sa channel na to Harriet the Bold Influencer and we are going to do this pero bago man tayo magsimula we will just uh do a 30 seconds of pause for you people, for you who watch this review to like this video. So, I will not speak for 30 seconds and I will pause the music. We Please like this video, share, comment what you think of Sicho Diablo. I had a good time watching this movie. Like a really good time. And perhaps there will be some changes in the tier list. So, without further ado... Bago, bago pa tayo magsimula, sige, post muna natin music at tayo ay mag-like ng video na to. Uh, shoutout sa mga 3,000 subscribers natin. Salamat po sa inyo. Uh, like nyo yung video. Just leave a like, subscribe. Uh, para po more video, mga kaharyat apologies natin yeah. so okay let's turn on the music shall we because it's friday and you know what that means nireba na natin ang viva max movie review every friday we will call this fridays with viva max featuring bold review yes bold review makes everything better and we are kicking up with the return of our tribal chief chief tres chief ten chief tes, uh the uh, undisputed face of uh, Viva Max platform which is uh, AJ Raval and woo! you know when i uh, yung expectations ko dito sa Sitio Jablo akala ko parang ano hugas part 2 na naman siya but i was wrong I kinda enjoy this movie. Yeah, I really do. And maganda yung pacing ng sex scenes dito. Parang, it's, uh, I've timed it. It's every 15 to 16 minutes. There's a new, uh, banging scenes dito sa Sitio Diablo. And, I, yung grain ng, ng ano, cinematography dito, it's very bleak, very dark. It really, uh, accentuates the, ano, the uh, premise of the gang wars na pinap na inilalahad dito sa Sitio Diablo. So what is Sitio Diablo? Well, we start up with a gang war. So ang um, uh, gangs dito the Illustrados, we, we we know it's the Illustrados because they keep on flashing that name every single frame na um, andun sila. So every time uh, they there's a frame that involves Illustrados members may Illustrados na pinaplash. It's kind of like the Civil War na mga siyudad pinapakita. And yeah, I think they overplayed it. They overplayed that a uh, bit too much. And such as that. Uh, AJ is played. AJ is playing the role of Aina. Like Aina sa Halinin o Gundam. So yeah. When it comes to uh, the uh, when it comes to that part, oops, because of sandali. Okay. When it comes to that part, uh, she did pretty good. Pretty good. So AJ plays the role as Aina. She is the girlfriend of our leading man, Kiko Estrada, who plays Bullet. Yeah, is a. Di ko alam kung yun yung yung pangalan pero siya si Bullet. Bullet leads the Illustrados gang. And they face up with the Gangos, the Los Eos Diablos, or Diablos for short, led by Tonix, who is uh, Aina's uh, brother. And from there, we go to a flashback. Parang ano, so in the perspective of Aina. So, yung Illustrados kasi, kumalas sa, ano, sa Los Eos Diablos, which rules the land the sacred land of Manila, aka Tondo, under the under the banner Sitio Diablo, which was called Sitio Santiago. And the ruling gang dito sa Sitio Diablo ay yung Diablos. 
but si Tonix kasi parang kinulong siya that's why medyo lumuwang and there are some splinter groups sa sa dia, sa Sitio Diablo like the Aztec who still on operates under Tonix's rule kasi nga yun yung ruling gang and Illustrados are like the separate gang so Aztec is like the inferior gang that we get to see the start we get to see some build up of some characters yung role ni uh, yung ano yung ginampanan ni Pio Balbuena dito and yung kapatid ni ano ni AJ Raval na si Ace Raval as Ascal and the likes so Tonix was uh, freed by Joko Diaz who is a corrupt cop and this corrupt cop is working under a corrupted mayoral candidate named Mag- Madang- Magtanggol ba yun? Artemio, si Artemio and we get to see a lot of political references there meron mga ditong mga BBM Sara I think the 20 pesos per kilo na bigas minention rin dito as a joke yeah this is such a political film I'm pretty surprised now that's not what you want to see that, that politics is not what you want to see what about the scenes the mature the adult swims maganda yung ano Kiko and AJ yeah, this is typically like the AJ special. Yung she will ride on uh, Kiko Estrada for a bit, and she will groan and she will moan. But yung mga stealing ano dito is the Aztec girls and the uh, Tonics over there. Tonics was freed and he had some fun with some girls, and Tonics was free to lead back Los Ios Diablo, so Aztec got assimilated, and what a role they have parang hinara sila yung medyo maraming gang member yung mga other gang members sa splinter sa kanilang ano and they were forced to join uh, evident dito yung parang fraternity initiation pinalo sa pinadel pinainom ng laway like that at kung pinili mo ay langit you will have a intercourse with the leader tonics and we've seen some foursome in this movie this is very uh, brutal rin Yung violence dito is off the charts. I see one member of the Illustrados got beheaded when they attempt to splinter away. Kasi nga kuya ni AJC Tonix. And they attempt to splinter away from the group. And as a as payback, isa sa mga grupo nila, pinugutan ng ulo. Ngayon, nung pinugutan yung ulo isang ka- ka- grupo nila or ka-member ng Illustrados, dito na napagpa siya na si Kiko na no more Mr. Nice Kiko no more Mr. Nice Bullet to form uh, an alliance sa mga iba pang ano to take on the Diablos so we got a big gang war that happened si Aina she was not gonna be involved pero isa sa mga ano member ng Lustrados is actually a mole kay ano kay Tonix and she found out she got angry kasi but siya, but sila trinaidor, di ba? Mole na alam niya kung saan dadaan yung mga illustrados in order to ambush them across the street. Now, this uh, be, this uh, gang war is reflected back to the beginning. Ito yung pinakita sa beginning talaga. And most of the illustrados died. I think si Aino na lang yung tirang illustrado na buhay. And most of the Diablos naman, I don't know if anyone survived but they also died. Uh, Joko Diaz, the corrupt cop, comes into the scene and cleans up this mess. He also killed Tonix on the side, but uh, he underestimates Aina, so he because he let him he let her live, and that would bite him in the ass. Because pinatay siya ni Aina in the end. So that is uh, the story of City of Diablo. Aina was the last woman standing dito sa pelikula to, and I think that would cement her as the queen ng City of Diablo. Uh, yun, maraming ano dito influences of drugs of uh, gang wars reflection sa mga lifestyle ng hardcore tondo dati and yeah, now ito na inaabangan natin what about the tier list guys what about the tier list so tier list natin okay uh as you can see, may dinagdag ako bago dito The Girl Friday, which is on September 30 But we are here to rate uh, Illustrados, I think we're gonna put Illustrados All Nighter 
I think the sex scenes, the adult scenes are very very good. I think this is one of uh, I think this is AJ's uh, best outing para sa akin ah. Or maybe her second, but I think this is the her best outing. But the mature scenes kasi alam ko na yung telegraph ko na yung forma ni AJ sa mga mature roles niya. I think most of the good scenes here is from the Aztec girls and their foursome with the leader which is to- who is named Tonix. Yun. And yeah, that's my take on City of Diablo. It's an all-nighter. If you want a good uh, bang for your buck, you can watch it. You can. It's repeatable. Maganda rin yung kwento. It's uh, something else na movie. Now, this Sunday, uh, we will review episode... What episode are we? in yung episode natin sa ano wag mong agawin ng akin episode ano na ba this is uh, we are in episode 5 uh, episode 5 na wag mong agawin ng akin and next Friday Ayana Misola returns with Bula yan yan yung mga review natin in our bold review bold review makes everything better okay So yeah, this is it for today. I hope you enjoy this content. And if you want to watch Sitio Diablo, note kayo sa Viva Max. Hindi ako nag- kung gusto nyo ng link, it's fine. It's uh, it's fine. It's uh, very very good. Eh, uh, hindi ako nagbibigay ng link. Bawal pirata dito, okay? So, kung hihingi kayo link, bibigay ko sa inyo directly, mag-subscribe sa kayo sa Viva Max. Mas mura siya sa Netflix. And that is it for me. Have a good, that's a goodbye and good night. Bang! I should go.